While summer is a break from school, it doesn't have to be a break from learning. In this week's edition of What I Learned at Summer Camp, Delane Cleveland shows us a program that allows kids to be scientists for a day. And this is a sedimentary rock here, if you want to pass that around. It may be June, but that doesn't mean schools are empty. So you can see this right here. In fact, there's some serious learning going on in this Maple Grove classroom, mixed in with a bit of fun. Most of the things we do are hands-on activities, because science isn't done by reading books, it's done by getting your hands dirty. Adam Hesch is a scientist from High Touch High Tech of the Twin Cities. His company is leading this Scientist for a Day summer camp. And it started about two years ago with a mission to create more scientists around the world and to get kids interested at a younger age. There you go. This four-day camp focuses on a different area of science each day. Did you find it? On this day, the topic is geology, so the kids literally get their hands dirty while searching for rocks buried in sand. Yep. Hesh refers to his teaching method as edutainment. Because that seems to be how kids are learning these days, through entertainment while being educated. By all accounts, the kids seem to be enjoying themselves. Just ask nine-year-old Natalie Madden of Maple Grove. I have been exploring nature since I was tiny, like this tiny, and um, I just like it. I just like science. All right, take about another minute. Madden is one of several girls taking part in this summer camp, and she's on a mission to prove the doubters wrong. Science is awesome, and girls can be a scientist, which some people don't think is possible. Find three of your favorite gemstones. Hesh says that one of the most positive experiences he's had while teaching these classes is seeing just how much the female students get into it. That's one of the biggest things that's lacking in the uh, science world is a huge female component. And sometimes I have classes where it's nothing but girls, and it's awesome. The hope is that some of these students become scientists in the future, or at the very least, start looking at the world in a different way. In Maple Grove, Delaying Cleveland, CCX News. The Scientists for a Day Camp is one of the many programs offered by the Osseo Area School District this summer, and for a list of summer camp options, you can go to our website, ccxmedia.org. I like that. No one's going to tell her she That's can't right. be a scientist. That's right. She can be a scientist. You go, girl. <laughs>